Uh, Andrew Coleman and I'm a senior. It's been going good. Uh, it's been a little busy for a senior year, um, but other than that, it's good. Uh, all the college stuff is the most challenging, I feel like. Uh, just, just like, uh, just getting all the college stuff done for the years to come, and I feel like that's the most intriguing stuff right now. Uh, I feel like senioritis is when you're really tired and you don't want to do anything like no homework and like you just like shrug it off and you just don't like uh, worry about your grades or anything like that. Ooh, um, I don't know. Um, I probably, um, uh, I don't know, the old saying where my dog ate it or something like that. I don't, I don't really know. I, I've never, I usually turn in my homework on time, but through the senior year, I've, I've really been late on my, my work, but uh, I've never really used an excuse. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> it was probably an art one. Uh, she gave me an assignment to draw Baby Yoda, and I'm a big Star Wars fan, so I really like that. Um, Mr. Moss has really made an impact on me. I'm a really a big his, history buff, and uh, we I had him for U.S. history and dual credit, and we really talked about a lot in there. And as well as Mr. Toon, Mr. Toon is really cool. His, his government class is really uh, I really talked to him a lot. So, oh man, um, probably in another country. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. <laughs> um, uh, I'm thinking about doing the military. Uh, I'm, I don't know, maybe, uh, probably, hopefully having a wife, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> that's, that's the big question. And uh, yeah, probably somewhere in, in another country doing my job or something like that. Uh, my family and my mom, uh, she's been my rock throughout these few, High school, uh, my high school career, and uh, she's really uh, been hel helpful with me. I'm inspired by my dad. My dad really inspires me. Um, he's really a hardworking man, and uh, he, um, he, we always make jokes and stuff. We're always talking, and uh, we always laugh at a few things. So, yeah. I am disappointed with, um, I feel like my work, work ethic has been a little crappy throughout this last year. Um, other than that, um, I don't know. I think that's it. I will never forget the memories at um, my high school. Uh, it was, it's been a really impactful four years for me throughout this high school. So, um, Probably the truth and never lying. Um, we've had a few of those throughout my friend group, uh, but we, we, we stick together. Um, that's the thing. Uh, yes, I'm involved with a lot. Uh, I, I was involved in football, involved in track. I'm currently involved in class officer um, and uh, prom committee and uh, a few other things. Just work harder. Um, I feel like I've, over the years, I've kind of died down, but uh, I mean, just work harder and do what you have to do to get through high school. Huh, I'll probably remember all the friends I had, um, just the memories through the high school career, or my high school, and uh, yeah, that's what. Um, well, it's a funny moment. Uh, it was my freshman year, and uh, I was sitting next to a friend. I don't, I don't know who it was, but he, everybody was throwing around papers like paper airplanes in the auditorium. And uh, the, the uh, principals told us to stop. Well, uh, my friend threw the last piece of paper and it, <laughs> I tell you not, <laughs> we were in the back row too at the auditorium. I tell you not, he threw it and it went all the way, it was like, it was the last one and it went all the way down and it was just going straight, like it was just going straight. Well, Mr. Medina is sitting in the left stage and next thing you know, this paper airplane goes to the left and goes like a missile target to Mr. Medina. It hits Mr. Medina. 
directly on the head. And it was a pretty crazy moment. I, I just remember that. That was, that was really crazy when, what happened. But uh, everybody laughed about that. That was a pretty memorable moment. My day's screen time, uh, I'm usually a lot on my phone. Uh, I'm really a lot, probably like five hours. But other than that, I don't know. Uh, probably Bohemian Rhapsody by Queen and uh, probably Can't Help Falling in Love with You by uh, Elvis Presley and probably All My Exes Live in Texas by George Strait. So that's my top three. Um, nope, that's all. Go to and go Panthers. Ha, ha, ha.